Hey, it's Dr. Stephanie Davis again, and I am very excited to be here today to talk to you guys about one of the new oils that was released at convention, Siberian Fur. Uh, I know a lot of people have been frustrated about the inability to get white fur, but let me tell you, you're going to be super excited when you hear what Siberian Fur has to offer. Um, as being one of the furs, uh, you know it has, um, a lot of them have similar chemical properties. What's great about Siberian fur is it has a more prominent chemistry than some of the other furs. Now what's that mean? Basically, Siberian fur has um, more of the chemical constituents of all of the other furs. So all the other furs would have a little bit of each one of these, uh, but Siberian fur has higher percentage of each one of those constituents. What's that mean? You've got one oil that does lots of things for you. The other thing that I love about Siberian fur is it contains limonene. Hey, remember limonene's contained in the citrus oils and what that does for us is that's basically an antioxidant. That is basically our, um, it increases the glutathione in your liver which is your antioxidant which basically helps with anti-aging, anti-cancer, etc. The other thing that I love about Siberian fur is it has boral acetate. No, I'm not going to make you draw out the chemical structure um, but what I love about that is that is some a component that is uh, significantly important for boosting your immune system but also helps with relaxation. That's why with a lot of the furs you get that grounding, relaxing effect. Um, the other thing I like about Siberian fur, you'll remember um, that they always talk about whether it's a monoterpene or a diterpene like we talked about last time with rose or a sesquiterpene. Yes, those were a lot of big words. Monoterpene, what's that mean? Monoterpene means it's fast acting. It's going to work quick for you, but it's volatile. Volatile means it evaporates quick off. So um, what that means with Siberian fur is you're going to get quick acting effects. However, with this oil, one thing that would really be highly suggested would be to dissolve it in or dilute it in your roller bottles for fraction, with fractionated coconut oil. Now what's that do? Because it's a monoterpene, because it evaporates so quickly, when you dissolve the white fur into the fractionated coconut oil, it does two things for you. It helps your body absorb it, it keeps it from evaporating off, so it almost acts like a little sealant um, to hold the white fur up against your skin so you can absorb it. The other thing that's great is fractionated coconut oil is a fat, it's a lipid, that absorbs into your skin well. So that carrier oil is going to help keep that white fur from evaporating off and help you absorb it better. So things that you're going to be able to use this for, Siberian fur is great for respiratory support, it's great for emotional support, um, it's great for immune boosting. You can combine it with rosemary or eucalyptus or cypress to get very good help with respiratory issues. Um, and it's going to be great for soothing uh, irritated skin or irritated airways. So I hope that you guys are excited as I am about uh, getting to use my Siberian fur.